welcome to Red Door Studios. Thanks for tuning in. Ian John Peters, if you are a fart, I'd clench my cheeks so hard. <laughs> Just to make sure I never let you go. Is that my original quote? Become my battle song. It's fair to say that when I first came to Australia in 2008, the thought of love and marriage couldn't have been further from my mind. I was going to be young, free and single in a new country, so I definitely had other things planned. Well, I arrived in mid-December and met you early January, so thank you for ruining that for me. I'm just kidding, I, I wasn't that young, but neither were you. Someone told me once that a genuine friendship or relationship is like a long-term investment. The longer you are in it, the more you invest in it, the harder it is for you to let it go. When we met more than 14 years ago, I thought we would just be friends and that's it. That we would go on our own separate ways when your visa expired and try not to invest too much in us. We have been on so many trips together, um, but I do remember when we were in Sweden in the middle of the night, watching the northern lights dancing across the sky, thinking how content I was. I was in a fantastic place, having a once in a lifetime experience, and I was just thinking how happy I was that I was sharing it with you. was the one who then popped the question four years ago during our long distance relationship. I decided then that I didn't need I, that I didn't need any not in shining armor. I just need someone who gets me and you get me. I'm coming at you with a heart of gold. That precious glow is on me. I'm coming at you like a desert rose. They broke the mold with me. I don't really know when we were in love. In fact, I don't even remember when we actually became boyfriends officially. We just kept spending time together because we seemed to like it. So over 14 years later, it's evolved into what we are today, which is two grumpy men who have decided that we can, we can tolerate each other slightly more than we can tolerate the rest of the world. So here it is, after 14 years of investment, I have lost track of how many moves we've done so far. We have a new set of furniture, two puppies, and your fishes. I stand before you to tell people that you are a fart, but you are my fart. <laughs> Sasuri, your ability to always volunteer to put on a face mask, drink some bubbles and laugh, 
I've always admired your confidence, your wit, and dry sense of humour. You, you are uniquely, unapologetically yourself. Ian, your ability to put, put up with Siri, your sense of humour, similar to Siri, how you scared of most things really, but in most cases giving it willing to give it a go. You're a kind, generous person, and I love you equally as much as I love Siri. And the things that I love about you both, um, that you both love musicals and Disney more than anyone that I know, um, that you can never truly know if you love or hate each other when you bicker. You accept our, ours, so Ben and I's idea of a good evening as board games, cheese and wine. Oh, <laughs>